Awella, Mono Safel SK, original. Hello everyone, it's Melissa, the M of the M and H of Bespoke Hairstyles. This is an unusual, uh, well, not unusual, my first ever recording with my daughter, who is five. Say hello. Sorry, Susu. Hi. Hi. Um, Susu's five, and she's got what I would call short, um, medium to loosely curled hair. And the reason why I'm doing this recording is because I've had um, a few um, questions about styling little girl's hair and um, whose hair aren't long, basically. And one of the things we are passionate about, or it's very important to us, is that um, from this age and even younger, we're not pulling on our little um, niece, nephew, goddaughter, children's um, follicles. So I want to show you quickly, hopefully it's going to be quick, um, how I style um, Susu's hair and do it live and hope it would help you. Um, so you will need, you're not going to see much of me, um, but you're going to, I've, I've oiled her hair already with some castor oil and jasmine oil. I have um, earlier washed, co-washed her hair with um, kinky, curly, coolly, um, and it's washed and detangled and um, the oil helps and, and this product definitely does love it and then i've used a leave-in conditioner um which is be unique which just gives her curls a bit more definition um and it's, her hair just loves um belinda's moisture custard uh, and also if i was doing um twists loose twists i would use uh, mango twists on her hair uh, but this time I'm just using um, mustard custard and then I guess an accessory um, I'm not sure which accessory I'm going to use and um, a parting comb um, so you're not going to see much of me um, and I'm going to start now um, basically um, I don't comb um, I just use my fingers to detangle um, her hair so I have literally um, gone through her hair and um, just done that separated felt for any lumps or any bumps and patiently kind of gone through um, her hair. Um, I wanted you to see me do this live because I know as mums we all have our challenges with our little ones um, and I many times have pulled and have been told I'm hurting and I try to ease up um, when... Um, that, that is the case when I'm told I'm hurting. So hopefully I don't, I don't hurt her this time. Um, and you would need something for, to distract um, your little one. Um, in this case, she's watching Grandpa in my pocket. <laughs> now, okay, I'll start. So um, what I tend to do is um, look at the hair, um, how it is. You can see the length of her hair. Um, I would say it's, I would call this short. Um, short, kind of medium length. Um, Susu hasn't got fast growing hair, so th this is the way I've always looked after her hair. Um, now, I, I, I tend to, to do quick styling, I tend to look at how the hair has fallen, and I've kind of done prep work before, and just kind of parted it. When you are yawning, Susu, what do you do? Yeah. Please. Yeah? This is important for you to see it all live. <laughs> um, so that, um, yeah, do you, we, we all get it. It's, it's the same challenge with every parent. I'm trying to get them to sit still and do their hair without them kind of complaining that we're hurting them. Um, but I always say when we hurt them and they tell us, we have to recognise that it does because everyone's follicles um, are different. And, and, and also one of the things that um, I get and I've been um, quite aware of is, for example, if, um, Susu has thin um, strands, um, quite thin strands. Um, she might have very strong follicles, but I'm aware that um, even though she might have strong follicles, um, the front might be a bit weaker because I have weak, um, you can't see me there, I have weak front follicle um, area, so she might suffer the same. So wh when I'm styling her hair, I say don't pull back or don't, don't um, pull on the area that, um, or style in the same way all the time. Um, so every time I've styled, I've tried to, I just look at how the hair falls and kind of 
styles according style according to that. So okay, I'll start. So I never con roll. I always flat twist, um, and I flat twist because apart from the fact that it's easy to unravel, um, Susu's uh, hair is it's a bit soft and oh, a lot soft actually. But um, and also um, by the third day, her hair is um, her hair has basically started unraveling. So there is um, no point in doing a complicated style on her hair. Um, I tend to do quite simple style. And this I would call is like a snake. I'm just following like, it's just, just going to be a long snake patterned style. Um, and bear with me, because I'm doing it from the webcam, there are challenges in, in this. It's because, sorry Susu, you're going to have to not look at the um, program for a minute. It's frozen anyway. Um, there are challenges with um, trying to um, produce this style in front of the webcam. So, so can you see the program now? Yeah. Yeah, okay. Um, two strand twists I prefer because, um, can you see my fingers? I'm just pushing, putting one over the other basically. Because with two strand twists, um, you're not pulling as tight as you would with Conroe. And Conroe has three sections, two strand has two sections. So um, it's just healthier um, for little heads and everyone's follicles, really. Okay, so I am following the pattern of her hair. So her hair, the way I've parted it, is kind of falling to, towards the right um, side. Um, I've just realized that the camera, the webcam's on a mirror um, image. Um, so yeah, it is on, on her right. So it's kind of falling. So I'm stretching the hair. I'm just following the pattern of the hair basically. And that's what I do a lot of the time. Um, as I said, this is live, this is a guide. It might not necessarily come out um, as ideally as I would like, uh, but is because I'm standing in an awkward because I want you to see what I'm doing. Um, I'm standing in an awkward place. Susu, you okay? I, I, am I hurting you? Mm. Is mommy hurting you? A little bit. A little bit. Where am I hurting you? Yeah. There. Okay. So the reason why it's hurting is because I have to have to um, hold on to it a little bit tighter when I'm trying to do the flat twist design. Um, Susu, does yeah. it hurt here? No, it doesn't. So when um, when I finish that section um, and I let and I've twisted it in, it should not hurt. It will hurt her a little because I'm trying to grab it in because I need this to last for the next at least five days for school. Um, also, um, you could use clips. I, I I'm not using clips. I I don't think I need to. But I've got the clips ready just in case um, I need them. Right, Susu. I'm going to push you back. Can you see so far what I've done? Yeah. You can't, Susu. I'm, I'm talking to the webcam. Um, okay, so again, I continue twisting through. And I'm putting just like tucking them in under each other. That's it. I'm just putting. When you yawn, Susu, what do you do when you yawn? Please do not do that again. Okay. So there's two ways of doing um, a two-strand twist. I tend to do it like this because I want to um, feel my way through what I'm doing. Sorry, Susu, I'm going to push you a bit. Another way of doing it is um, basically take using... Your, this is hard for me to describe because it's something I've always done and I've really not thought about how I do it. Um, and I do it for clients as well. Um, so, so keep your head like that, please. Um, and, and, and it's literally holding it on, on I think it's above and still pulling it under. Um, and I can also do it in uh, different ways, but um, I'm doing it in the, in the easiest way possible. So I'm gonna switch again and just show you how I do it uh, because I can feel if there's a hair loose, I can pull it into the twists. Okay. So again, I'm kind of looking at what I'm doing and kind of following through. 
uh, bend your head down a bit, you see. Um, normally this is a 10 minute styling, but because it's, it's for um, Sahela's hair, it will take a little bit longer. But, again, I say, I want you to see it live. Um, and the reason is, is because I want you to understand that even when I'm, uh, as a stylist, I like all, all sorry Sissy, that's going to hurt, that tangle a bit. Um, all of us have the same challenges, you know, I've had a long day and I need her hair to be decent for the rest of the week. And I've got to sit her down and get her hair detangled and styled. Um, so I just want to show you that, I, I, like you, I, I have absolutely the same challenges and I try to style her hair. I'm lucky, I know I'm lucky, her hair texture is different, even, though well, we all have different hair textures, but her hair is a tightly, tightly um, curled, um, so it's easy to, to manage really. Um, put your head up a bit, baby. Thank you. Okay. So, all throughout, as I'm twisting, because, okay, the, the idea is I want Sahela to know that her hair doesn't have to be long. Um, her hair is perfect. So, so your hair is perfect just the way it is. Yeah. Okay, mommy. Yeah, okay. Um, lift your head up a bit, Susu. That's it. Um, her hair, your hair is perfect just the way it is. And you can look cute and nice still with... Um, a short hairstyle um, because I tend to bring all her hair in and um, tucked in to itself because um, she looks beautiful like that could you just keep your head like that please Susu Susu we're coming to the end now so just a quick one okay you can't see what I'm doing I'll try and show you what I'm doing Susu again okay I'll bring you close because we're coming to the end Okay, so I am again just pulling the hair in, making sure I'm not pulling too tight. Because of the length of hair at this point, I'm tending to hold it in a different way from the way I started. Um, and I guess it's better for you to kind of see it um, and work with what skills you have. But please, not at the cost of your your little one's follicles. Okay, we're coming to the end, so this bit is important. What do I do? How do I pull up? What do I do? Um, and I'm constantly thinking, you all right, Susu? Yes, Mom. Okay. Good girl. Right, we've come to the end, and at this point, I will twist. Susu, you can watch your program now. Thanks. So I'm just going to twist. Mm -hmm. Susu, I'm not talking to you, I'm talking to the camera. Oh. Can you see what I've done? See the back? And can you see I'm just twisting it? I'm twisting it with the idea of finding a space to kind of tuck it in. So this is my quick, well, it's under 15 minutes. And considering that I kind of spoke to the camera initially, um, so um, this is the advantage of this hair length. Um, this hair length, it doesn't take too long to get it styled. Um, I've just kind of, I mean, you could add bubbles, you could put bowls, I sometimes with a bowl, um, you could bead the ends, and but um, I just want it all kind of tucked in. So, bend your head back a bit. There's the loose, and I'm literally just going to find a space to kind of tuck her hair in. And I think I'll do it there. Um, that. And it will move, you know, because she's going to use her bonnet um, and it will probably move. But um, I've just tucked it under itself and there it is. Um, a style under 15 minutes for little heads. What do you think, Susu? Do you like? I'll bring the webcam close so you can see what I've done. Twisted. Into itself. Look down, baby. And that's it. That's Susu ready for school tomorrow. Sorry. There. Hope this helps. Do you like Susu? Yes. Yeah. Mm -hmm.
Can How I does your head feel, Susu? Better. Better. Did mommy hurt you lots? Not. No, much. not much. Not much. Say bye to the camera. Bye. Bye. Oh, that's nice. That's it. Um, hope this helped you. Um, and if you like my head wrap, sorry. Oh, that light's disturbing me. If you like my head wrap, I'm a, I'm going to do a tutorial after this recording, um, just to show you how I did this. Um, so stay posted. But thank you for watching this posting. Um, as my daughter falls off the chair, thank you for watching this posting, and I hope it helped. I'll try to do another one, but for mums with little girls with short hair, this is a possible style that you could consider. Part the hair, look at the motion movement of the hair, and then just twist away and go with it. Thank you. Stay connected. Take care, everyone. Bye. Ah, well, Mono Safel SK, original, official ringer. Ada, lawyer, any cement present, yeah, street laughter. Que, 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 on y va. Tous les mondes est présenté, vos chansons, s'il vous plaît, voici votre SK Blix, original, official ringer. Ada, Afrique, balancez, balancez, Afrique, bougez, bougez, Afrique, balancez, balancez, Afrique, bougez, bougez. Balancé, balancé